A Book for Escargot, story by Dashka Slater, pictures by Sydney Hansen, read with permission from publisher Farrar Strauss, Giro Books for Young Readers. Bonjour! I see you are reading a book. I will try not to distract you. It can be distracting to have a very beautiful French snail staring at you while you read. My name is Escargot, and I am on my way to check out a book at the library. It will be a French cookbook filled with delicious French recipes. Escargot is going to cook something new. You should try something new as well. Have you ever kissed a snail? Now might be a good time to try it. While we are traveling to the cookbook section, we can talk. Tell me, what is your favorite book? Is it Goldie Tentacles and the Three Snails? Harry Gastropotter and the Chamber of Salads? Good night, snail? A very hungry snail? Where the wild snails are? There are so many books to choose from. Books about dog superheroes and guinea pig detectives and flamingo astronauts and halibut firefighters all have exciting adventures. But I must tell you something sad about these books. So sad, you might cry. I am crying just thinking about it. Will you wipe my eyes for me? And also my nose? It's okay to use your sleeve. Okay, now I will tell you the very sad thing. Not one of these books is about a daring snail hero who saves the day. All the books about the snail make a joke about slow snail or shy snail. I am not laughing at this joke. You do not look like a laughing at snails person. You look like a clever person who reads serious books about handsome animals. You probably know many fancy words. With these fancy words, you could write a sentence. Extraordinaire like, the gallant gastropod gallivants to the rescue, which is another way of saying, the daring snail hero saves the day. Tell me. Have you ever written a book? You should try it. Do not worry, Escargot will help you. It is just like cooking from a recipe. Add the ingredients, mix them together, and voila, a perfect story. You must begin by introducing the main character. Once upon a time, there was a very beautiful French snail hero. If you want, you can add some details about my most beautiful parts, like my shiny brown shell, or my translucent tentacles, or my chic outfit. Ooh la la, you might need to get more paper. But perhaps you think... The main character of a story must have a problem, Escargot. You are so handsome, suave, and smart. What problem could you possibly have? I will tell you. Always I eat salad with a few croutons and a light vinaigrette. It is magnifique. But one day I wake up and I have a strange feeling. I am bored bored of eating salad. Maybe I will learn to cook a green bean or a souffle or a ratatouille. Anything could happen when you have a daring snail hero like Escargot. But perhaps you think, I cannot wait to find out what you will cook, Escargot. Let us get to the cookbook right away. May no, it cannot be so. First, the daring French snail hero must overcome an obstacle. 
like this one, for example. Escargot is very far from the cookbook. The cookbook is very far below Escargot. But a daring French snail, he wrote, is not afraid of heights. A daring French snail, he wrote, can overcome this obstacle by flying. You don't believe that a scargo can fly? Count to three, and I will show you. One, two, three. That was too fast. I wasn't ready. Maybe you should count in French. Un, deux, trois. Still too fast. I think maybe I need a little push. Did you see me fly? I was like an eagle. I just had a little trouble with the landing. But that does not matter because I have arrived at the cookbook. And now we will have the resolution of the story. This is the happy part at the end where the daring French snail hero solves his problem by being bored with salad by using the cookbook to make a delicious feast. Bon appetit! But this is not the right cookbook. This cookbook is not about cooking food for escargot. This cookbook is about cooking escargot for food. The ingredients, garlic, butter, me. What if a French chef comes to the library to check out this book? He will cook escargot for dinner. You must tell the chef to choose a recipe for French toast, or French bread, or French fries. But not beautiful French snail. Also, could you cover me with your hand so he cannot see me? While I am inside my shell, not hiding, but more like having a private moment. You? can continue writing. I will start the sentence and you can finish it. Escargot, the daring French snail hero, was not eaten by the French chef because... Uh-oh, Escargot might have eaten the cookbook. I do not think I will be learning how to cook the green bean or the ratatouille, or the souffle. But, on the other hand, nobody will be learning how to cook me. The daring French snail has defeated the dangerous recipe. Escargot has saved the day. This book we have written, it is magnifique. And do you know how it ends? with a kiss. Mwah. The end.